guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a homeschool haul. I have not done one in quite a long time and there's a reason for that. If you follow me then you already know that I am just trying to be more... I am just trying to be more intentional and responsible about what I bring into our homeschool just because I have been down that road of feeling like, you know, that one good homeschool haul would change your whole entire homeschool life. So um, I'm just kind of trying to take a more minimalistic approach um, to what we get for homeschool and actually use the things that we have. One of the major resources that we use is the library. You guys already know that. So while I love um, purchasing books and being able to add it to our library, we actually don't do that because I just found that it was a waste for the amount of books that we try to get through and the things that we love. However, I like never, ever, ever, I feel like, get to do homeschool hauls. And I go into the stores and there's so many things that I want to buy that I choose not to buy and I choose to go home and use the resources that I already have. And that's been working out really, really well for us. Now, let me fast forward to now. I'm super excited because I am doing a haul today and let me explain. So I am doing a haul because I went to the store to pick out a bunch of things that I would have purchased for myself, but instead I purchased them for you guys. I'm so excited. Uh, so you guys already know that we have um, a business called The Falco and then The Falco Kids. And one of the things that I have been working on there is a marketing plan. For our marketing plan, I'm really going to be focusing on our Instagram accounts because I feel like, and, and YouTube here too, as part of like the behind the scenes. I feel like that'll be the best place for me to be able to really get our vision out there and just be as creative as possible. So as a part of my marketing efforts, I was just really praying about it like Lord how do I go about marketing and the thing that I thought about the most was give and it shall be given to you so that made me super excited because the first thing I thought was let me head to the store <laughs> so um, we're about to roll out a series of giveaways we want to make it a regular thing to just give away things that we found that we love along with our teas of course so, um, as a part of our marketing plan, I was able to go out shopping and pick up a bunch of things that I would love to have purchased for myself, but instead, I purchased them for you guys. What better way to gather a bunch of new homeschool goodies than to go out and shop for them for you guys? So, I'm just going to be showing you, hopefully on a somewhat regular basis, the things that we pick up to give away. That kind of gives you a preview of what we will be giving away on our accounts um, here through YouTube and then on our Instagram account. And make sure you guys go and enter and tell all your friends because I want to give this stuff away. So I'm going to get straight to it and show you what I got. I'm really excited because I get to be really creative with how I put together the little giveaway packages, but I'm basically just going to show you how I do it. So this is technically like... I don't know, a little bit creative business, a little bit homeschool. Um, I want to be able to include the kids in on these videos more, but for right now, it's just a lot easier for me to go through them. And as um, things get a little bit easier for me, then I can just kind of include them in on the mix. So that's where we're starting. So I went to, where did I go? I went to Ollie's. You guys know that already. <laughs> so I went to Ollie's. Um, I also went to Target and I also went to Hobby Lobby. All of my books were from Ollie's, but then my other little bits and pieces were from Target. I got in the clearance section and I'm going to show you how I use them. The Target clearance section is amazing. So first I got these, this little, these binder clips, which I thought were perfect. And they just say create, I can, I will, you got this. And they are so cute. They're black, pink, and white. And I thought I could toss them in with our giveaways. So I got two packs of these. How cute are these? The next thing I got were these cute little um, paint tins. They're perfect to add to the little giveaway boxes. And I can use them for different things. So this one I just emptied. And I'll use all of the bits and pieces in different ways. Maybe two package or to use them in a totally different way. But I got all of this washi tape out of it. So this is just half of the washi that came out of the bin. 
I think I got six of them, which I should totally go back and get more. I wasn't exactly sure how I was going to use them, but now that I have a better idea, I think I'm going to go ahead and get more. Washi is perfect for us in homeschool. We use them for so, so many things, and I probably should just do a separate video about how we use them. But you can spell with washi. You can use them for planning, of course. Um, the kids can use them inside of their notebooks just to highlight um, different important notes in different ways. It's just fun. Kids like using tape. Having washi is always a good thing. Okay, now you guys, I'm going to go on to what I got from Hobby Lobby. Um, these actually ended up being 50% off, which I think I'm going to go ahead and stock up on some more. But I thought it would be perfect to add to the mix mugs. So I thought throwing in a mug with a tea would be the perfect little... Um, gift packaging for one of my mamas so i just got some of my favorites i got this hello sugar one i know you guys have seen this one i have it in black it's the i got this says god this one says like a boss which would be perfect for us because whether you have a small business which i'm finding out you guys have dreams to have businesses or have them already um and that's really cool and i want to talk about that and you know more in the future but and then I've got this one, which I absolutely love, the You Got This. And it has little polka dots and gold on the side. And then the last thing that I got from Hobby Lobby were, um, was these really cute pencils. I thought it would be nice to just throw in a couple of pencils and tie them with some string just to add to the gift bags. And then the last thing I have, which guys is super cold out here because it is definitely snowing today. And you know I have my garage door open because this is where I film. And this is where my little office space is. But anyway, so now on to my books. You guys, I am too hyped about getting to go to Ollie's more now. So I'll show you what I got. So I got this, The Beautiful Word. It's 100 illustrated NIV scriptures to nurture your spirit. This one is so, so pretty. The next one I got is um, called Play With Fire. I have been wanting to read this for a very long time and it was at my alley so it was perfect and I went ahead and picked it up. Discovering fierce faith, unquenchable passion, and a life-giving God. This one is by Emily Lay. Embracing simplicity and celebrating joy, grace, and not perfection. I have not read this one either. However, I did attend a Making Things Happen intensive years ago where I met her. Um, so it's so awesome to see things that are created by real people, even though most things are created by real people. But you know, like people that you've met and you've seen them grow. And yeah, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> anyway, but it's a beautiful book. I have not read it myself, but I thought it would be the perfect gift for one lovely mama here. The next one I got is called Chasing Slow. You guys might already know about this book. I follow her on Instagram. Courage to Journey Off the Beaten Path. I want to read this one myself. I haven't read it, but it's a beautiful book and I've heard wonderful things about it. So I picked this one up as well. The next ones were this. These four books were so cute and I am always a sucker for anything that has neon in it. So uh, these were my favorite. But Bubbles Ocean Friends. This one was super cute, and it's by Silver Dolphin Books, which I love. Um, Silver Dolphin Books also makes the build kits that we use that I wish were made a little bit better, but we love them anyway. <laughs> I always set that disclaimer, just so you know, if you happen to get them and you get a little frustrated with them, you understand that I made it very clear. This one is Shadows Nighttime Adventure, another board book by Silver Dolphin with this amazing neon all over it i love this book it is so pretty and then it has the little metallic silver inside it's just really it's really a gorgeous book the next one i got is called walk with me it is by margaret wise brown she is the author of good night moon this one's really really super cute and the illustrations, you guys know, I don't buy a book that doesn't have incredible illustrations. So, <laughs> so um, this one is called Walk With Me. This one is also by Margaret Wise Brown. And you guys, look at these illustrations. <laughs> they are so cute. Um, Be Brave Little Tiger is this one. 
This one is looking at Lincoln. This would be for the older child, I guess, um, it, considering how much you've gotten into civil rights. It's beautifully done, beautifully illustrated, and lots of good information. A nice conversation starter in history. Um, it's just really, really pretty, and I was so glad that I found it. And then the last one I got is Jonah and the Whale. It was just cute, okay? <laughs> so I went ahead and picked this one up. It looks like this, wait, yeah. It looks like this author also has Noah's Ark, the Easter story, Joseph and his coat of many colors, and in the beginning. So it would be so nice if I could find these other books at a different Ollie's. But sometimes with Ollie's it's hit or miss and you just have to ride each visit out and hope for the best. So this is the last one that I got. So that's it you guys. That is my homeschool haul for now. I'm excited because this gives me a reason to go homeschool haul shopping <laughs> just so I can give away to you guys. I'm hoping that this is just a fun way to connect and encourage one another and just have a little bit more fun in homeschool. We really have to create our community because we don't have co-workers and such. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Please be on the lookout for the giveaways. I am really excited about starting a new series that at the end of each video will have um, the information for when the new giveaway has been posted. More hauls finally back to my channel because they're so much fun. Um, but I had to do them the right way and for me the right way is being able to give so I get that gratification of going shopping but I also get the extra gratification of knowing that it is going to encourage and you know add a little bit more fun to your days so I will see you in the next video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up make sure you're subscribed talk to me in the comments and we will see you in the next video bye can you see my <laughs> Can you see my breath? Let me see. I got something from myself from Joanne. <laughs> so these are going in the never mind. <laughs>